It was yeah. Simple. Yeah. Yeah. That's real simple. What's your yeah. vote then? I'm for just going ahead and passing it and construction management. Yeah, I mean, come on now. Um, some I, people I, have dealt with stuff where everybody else has. I make a motion that we submit to the quorum court Thursday night that we vote to pass on this project. I second that. Why don't you hold out to your chairman? I'll second it. Okay. I'll second it. All in favor say aye. No. All opposed like that. Okay, thank you. That's what y'all are going to recommend to the full court Thursday yes. night. And then the, the court will vote on that. And then if y'all get the full court, go to construction manager. We'll be. And I'll have the uh, team to get back together and uh, greater. And uh, lowest greater highest one to both points. We'll get that contract. We'll go from there. Okay. You, you reserve the right in that to reject it. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's all I need. I'm going to ask one more question. Hey, for me. I got a question. If okay. you're going on points rather than dollars, yeah. if there's a big dollar amount, you're still going to go on points? We don't need, the law will not allow you to even ask what they're going to charge you. They can't put that, they can't even put that oh, so in your qualifications. What person is just going to bid them by itself, right? They want them. The way I understand you, what you're saying is that it will be put for bid. No, the, Carl, the construction yes. management position will be put up for bid. Yes. And then after he gives what he's going to, he'll take care of the other bids. Yes. Well, the county is going to bond this thing now. If it goes this way. But, but I always, it, it'll be what, the construction manager is the only one we're going on points, right? Yeah, well, we've done an architect that way. And now we have to do the construction manager that way. But these, yes. sub, these contractors won't be done for it. No. Oh, no, no. They will okay. be going okay. forward right. by. Now, no, to get your, get your management team in place, the law is clear. You can't even ask them what they're going to charge you. Once the process is picked and, and uh, architect number A is a high score and architect C is a, whoever put in bids, then you go that A, whoever had the, the biggest, the most score. Then you sit down with him and you negotiate what you think is a fair price. And if you don't think that's fair, then you go down to the next bidder or person. Right on down. Hey, these schools have been doing this for a while. This is nothing. It's been there for a while. It's worked pretty good so far. Uh, every, every indication I've got, it's been good. Uh, you know, Southfield has been building these, and that's Spirit Architect. Now, I don't know if they will get the advisor side of it or not. Well, Y'all will have to score it, you know. But well, where did the school get all their help from? Through an advisor. Construction advisor. Yeah. And I usually... That's usually Gene or Frankenberger. Frankenberger was, has always been their architect. Mm -hmm. But he's retired now. Yeah. Retired, right. so. And then 